The huge cloud of highly flammable gas has formed around an offshore oil platform off Scotland. The oil company Total says it could take up to six months to stop the gas leak on its rig in the North Sea. Your correspondent Philip Williams reports. For the third day, the Elgin platform stood abandoned, powered down to reduce the risk of an explosion. No one's sure how to stop the leak, and it could be months before it stopped. I would say the relief well is, you know, is a minimum of six months, but we're freeing up uh, rigs that we have working for us in other areas so they can you know, be made available if that is the option that's progressed. Oil workers from a nearby rig run by Shell are also being taken to the mainland as a precaution. There's an exclusion zone affecting ships and planes after reports of a gas cloud forming around the rig, which is more than 200 kilometres off the coastal city of Aberdeen. Hydrogen sulphide, the rotten egg smell we get sometimes, in small quantities smells horrible. In relatively large quantities it is very toxic, very poisonous. Harmful to humans, also harmful to the environment. And the risk is not just above water. Escaping gas could also be damaging the marine environment. Memories are still strong of the Piper Alpha disaster when 167 workers were killed back in 1988. At least this time, everyone's clear of the area. The positive side, we've got everybody off, everybody's home, everybody's safe. But if this gas was to find an ignition source, you could see Piper Alpha. It's still too dangerous to approach the rig. A remote submarine will be used to help find and plug the leak. But the reality is at this stage, no one knows when it'll be safe to return to business as usual. Already there's been a tangible financial effect. The stock price for Total has gone down. The price of wholesale gas in Britain has gone up. And there's great uncertainty how this will resolve itself. Philip Williams, ABC News, London.